Hi, it's me again with Corrode Roll Tips and Tricks, and this is part two. I just made a video that was going to save me a lot of time rotating around the center of a page. But let's say you don't, and you could always work, but let's say your center of a page is full of artwork, and you want something over here. Well, first of all, you'd want these two things exactly on top of each other. So we're going to hit C, and it's going to put it in the center. But if we look now, it has moved my little dot that I had at negative seven. So what you need to do if you're going to do that, let me back up here, select that one first, then this one, and then hit C. The star moved and not the circle. My circle is at seven minus seven X minus a, um, a negative eight. Same thing what we did in the center of the page a while ago. We're going to go to Windows, Dockers, Transform or Transformation. We're going to rotate this star uh, 7 by negative 8 and just hit Enter. And it puts stars 22 and a half degrees, 15 of them, um, well, actually 16. Uh, so we got a copy, and you always want to do that. Uh, let me do that again. Since we already had a star, you just want 15 stars, then you won't have an extra one there. So always thinking about that, because whenever Corel says copy, it's going to make copies and keep the first one. So no matter where you are on the page, if you can draw a circle and make coordinates, and I did make it easy for the uh, video to, I mean, you could have eight and a half or, you know, if it was something like, that number, you're gonna have you're gonna have to write that down. Now you don't, you know, let's say you want it at that number, but once you've got it uh, selected, then you can move it around your page anywhere you want. You know, these are grouped together and you can put them, you know, wherever you want it to. Pretty cool. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.